The Adirondack Phantoms proudly present Beaver Tales with Dex. Before he was the fun-loving character that everyone adores today, Dax the Beaver was hardly a superstar with his share of issues. Born the only kid to a dam builder and a lodge keeper, Dax always had trouble fitting in during his youth. At a young age, Dax grew much larger than the other beavers. Dax really wasn't fitting in with his friends and family. That's when he decided to look outside of his habitat to try to make an impact. Dax attempted to make his way amongst people. But Dax's attempts to carry out a beaver's life in a human world quickly backfired. Calls rang into the mayor's office from residents who had dams built in their private pools. It was keeping me awake, sleepless nights, dealing with this beaver that was building dams in everybody's private pool in the city of Glensville. We engaged the police department on a, on a manhunt. We engaged the fire department, our code enforcement. Dax had trouble dealing with his brush with the law for trespassing and damnedalism. Frustrated with his inability to fit in with both beavers and humans alike, Dax turned to a habit that he wouldn't be able to shake. The comfort Dax got from popcorn turned into an addiction that consumed his life. Dax couldn't get enough of the salted indulgence. He began hoarding popcorn and wouldn't share a kernel with anyone. Eating made Dax grow even larger. It got to the point he could no longer fit in his lodge. Forced from his home, Dax went for a walk in the Adirondacks. What would happen next would change Dax's life forever. Also taking a walk that day was former Phantom's mascot Flex, fresh off of his retirement. When the two crossed paths, they could each tell the other was on a mission. Dax's mission was to find a place that he wouldn't be an outcast. Flex's mission was to find someone to replace him as the Phantom's mascot. Moved by Dax's story, Flex offered Dax his special cape. The cape gave Dax a new confidence and transformed him into an energized ball of fun. Flex knew he had found his replacement. Dax made his debut at a Phantoms game, January 28, 2011. He finally found a place where he belonged. There's no question the players started playing better. We started getting better results. We started winning hockey games, and the fans started to come into the building. It was all because of Dax. Master, he was entertaining the kids, and he became a huge community asset to the city of Glens Falls. It was, it was a wonderful, rewarding uh, feeling. Dax still enjoys popcorn from time to time, but in moderation. And now, he shares. Outside of hockey games, Dax helps kids make the right decisions with his goal program. After overcoming being an outcast, addiction, and runnings with the law, Dax has turned it all around for better and is gearing up for his second season with the Phantoms. Thank <laughs> you.